this is hydrogen tap. What we're doing here is looking at the Aaron cell twin two thirds. And I've had a number of emails asking to clarify how that two thirds system works. So I'm going to vote this entire video to that. Any of you who know everything there is to know about the Aaron cell or would rather me talk about something else, switch channels. This entire video is going to be discussing the two-thirds system and the cell. The Aaron cell consists, in this particular cell, consists of 15 stainless steel plates. Each plate is 0 .028 thick. They're an eighth of an inch part. I'm using hand cut square acrylic spacers that are 3 eighths inch. I should say 1 eighth inch. Each plate has on it a tap screw hole, which you can see here. It goes through it and a cutout. The plates can be reversed so that you can have the screw hole on either side. That means you can make them two or three positive plates or four positive plates, whatever you want, one direction or the other. Each plate has two holes in it that allow you to put a plastic or actually it's a nylon screw through it and I have a washer on this side, nylon also. goes through each plate have a spacer on the other side or two in this case to make up the difference for other plates that you can put in there with another spacer and another in a nut on the other side. Everything here is stainless steel including the electrodes that go through it all the holes that go through the plates are tapped, meaning that you have to screw the electrode in it in order to get the electrode through. The reason for that is that rather uniquely, the Aaron cell, you can space the plates on the top differently as you run it through. So you can make this wider by pushing these apart and then screwing the screw through them to hold them that way. The 3 8 system is a entree, so to speak, of the twin. The twin system has the two, three, screws here which enable you to make or turn off one side and the other. So if you have this running and it gets too hot you can turn off one of these electrodes and the other one will take up over. You can put a switch in between there. works really well. And that's what I have running in my car right now, the Honda. But what we're doing now with the two-thirds system is I've got five plates here. And these plates, seven plates here. These go to negative on the terminal of the battery. 
and I've got three plates here going to the positive. You can you can up it if you like. You can make it four and four. I'm using three and four. That means all these plates here are negative and three here are positive. I put a black tape on the positive plates and the positive electrode. So recap. Three plates in this electrode are positive. All the other plates are negative. The unique part about this is we could call this a reverse neutral plate system. As much as I hate using the word neutral plate, as everyone knows by now I don't believe in neutral plates. We could call this a reverse neutral because these plates here These four do not have any negative plate to go, do not have any positive plate opposite them. These four. They do have a negative plate opposite them. So negative and negative. These plates, these three, have three positive plates opposite them. So you have a negative and positive. Normally, in the Aaron cell, in most cells, you would have negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, all the way through it. The two-thirds system I use now which is producing all this hydrogen, does not do that at all. It only has six plates, essentially, that are opposite each, each counter. In other words, that are negative, positive, negative, and positive. Again, the plates I have covered in tape here and this, that's positive, all the rest are negative. So you have two electrodes, this one and this one, which are negative. In this case, it goes through all of these. This one over here is positive. Why this is producing so much hydrogen, I really don't know at this time. So we could call it a reverse, neg a reverse, reverse neutral plate system if you want to coin a new phrase. Again, this is the Aaron cell 15 plate system. You can go to hydrogentap.com and see it. I have it pretty well. I have a lot of pictures of the system there. If you want to write me, you can write to John Aaron's at hydrogentap.com. I hope this video will have helped. The other thing, this system right here, these plates have been in the lye which I use. Actually, I keep it in that lye situation all night. Matter of fact, these plates are in it all the time. I take it out just to do things like this, but 99% of the time it's in lie and you can see the plate hasn't suffered any problems whatsoever. So I use lye and distilled water.